night's video is sponsored by Skillshare. Have you always thought the pathway to many abilities sometimes seem to be a little bit out of reach? Skillshare is a place where all of those answers can be unlocked in a huge online learning community with thousands upon thousands of inspiring classes that you can choose from to help you become more of a wise and powerful being. The beautiful thing about Skillshare, unlike, say, falling asleep in lecture classes, which, being a professional sleeper, I occasionally did, is that you can always advance your classes at your leisure and fit everything in according to your schedule. Even if you've got a sporadic life, or one with, say, a little bit more time, you'll always be able to learn new skills at your pace, which we all know is the most effective way to unlock your creative abilities and in the comfort of wherever you are currently located. One of the courses I've been virtually attending is about cinematography and this course is taught by teacher Zach Mulligan. I think it comes as no surprise when I say that I love film. When I was younger I religiously watched all the behind the scenes to all the movies which I loved like Star Wars obviously, Lord of the Rings, Pirates of the Caribbean, Harry Potter, where my fascination flourished for the whole creative process and was probably one of the main sparks and reasons what got me interested in video creation. This course which I've been attending by Zags has been filled with tips about cinematography and has already pushed me in directions which I would never have thought about previously, which has been so awesome and why I've been binge watching his and a few other classes as well. So use my knowledge, I beg you, and the first thousand people to use the link in my description will get a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership and after that it's only around $10 a month to gain all the knowledge you seek. So actively be inquisitive, join Skillshare, enjoy learning new things and gain the knowledge you seek. Lula, wake up, wake up, wake up. Are you awake? I just wanted to wake you up. Um, I checked everyone's tickets along here and I noticed that um, I did not check yours. So can I see your ticket, please? I know, please, please just remain calm for me. I know that uh, everyone had uh, their tickets checked by various people, but I personally like to uh, just check that everybody has their tickets checked by me. I know we're, we're mid-flight, please just calm down just a little bit, keep nice and relaxed for me. Nice and relaxed. Please don't raise your voice to me. And if you can just show me your ticket, please, that's all I require for you, just to show me your ticket so I can just check it for you and return it back to you and you can get on to enjoy your first class flight experience with us tonight here at British Air. Great. And then allow me to get that for you out of your bag, I see now, just pop that out there for you. Okay. See what we've got here. Okay, so let me have a look here. So I noticed that you printed this off yourself. Gosh, people are sleeping around us. We don't want to disturb them here in the first class. Okay, just just keep it nice and nice and relaxed environment for us whilst I check your ticket here. Okay, so can I just tell me your name? If you could just tell me your name. Take your name. Ah, there we go. That is indeed your name. And uh, where are you flying to today? Las Vegas. Excellent. And returning to London Heathrow. And where are you flying to? From London Heathrow. Excellent. So let me, uh, can I just move your leg out of the way there and just check your seat number? Yes, that is correct. You are on seat 35 here and you have your suite here. 
so of course your seat reclines and I notice that you have taken the liberty of reclining your seat already to get yourself nice and relaxed and no doubt sleeping so this won't take any time whatsoever um, can you tell me what gate you went to oh, everybody remembers what gate they went to how could you not remember what gate you went to yes 46 okay um, and this is boarding pass here so there we go if you like that, 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 that no, 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 no. I forgot to stamp it there for you there's my very special stamp here I uh, got this in the lost and found department okay so uh, just get your ticket stamped here okay and stamp a little bit there here as well and we give it plenty of stamps so we know that your ticket has officially been seen by me uh, so perhaps we just stamp it there This is the return ticket. I do believe you have given me the return and not the departure ticket. Oh dear, oh dear. So now this has been used as your return thing. No, please don't stress. Please, shh, shh, shh. Don't, don't, don't stress now. There we go. Just keep nice and relaxed there. Nice and relaxed. And, uh, apologies for touching you there. No, no please. Um, well, I'm sure that we here at British Air can get that sort of view. How about if you just leave that with me and I, I will get that uh, rectified there for you. Get a little bit trigger friendly when it comes to boarding passes. So, uh, please may I see the, your departure boarding pass ticket. Would that be okay? Uh, no, I know it's in your bag there. Uh, this one here. Self-printed again. We did not wish to collect the nice version of the ticket. Uh, I noticed that your printed ink appears to have run out here. Of course, I know you don't want to talk about the printed ink, but just the same thing. I'm just going to make sure that this is being checked here for you and officially seen.
Britain. So this is just to check off the Las Vegas from London Heathrow. Okay, so here is your ticket. It's been nice and checked there for you. So allow me to pop that back in your bag there for you. Okay, and please, I'm so sorry to wake you there. And I hope that I didn't disturb you at all. Uh, now, being in the first class suite, you can have anything that you want. Um, I'm here to serve you and make sure that your flight is the very best it can be here on the British Air. Okay, so just give me a bus if you need anything and I will spot you from afar and run directly to you to help you with your every need. Okay, so how does how does that sound there? I don't, I'm sorry, it's just a habit of touching um, passengers. Okay, they've told me about that before. So anything else I can... Okay, so you wish to get it Of course, I, I get the hint. You wish to go back to sleep. That is perfectly fine. I will leave you to your peaceful slumber here, okay? I will not disturb you anymore, okay? So this is quite a fruity and punchy smell. 
in here as well, but it doesn't stop there. Please, uh, I will just take a little bit more of your time. I want to make sure that you, you will have a tea just in case you need one. There's no need to raise your voice at me whatsoever. I will be uh, away from you very shortly. And we have something from DJ Radio called Wakey Wakey. This one, as you are trying to sleepy, sleepy, and uh, I think this will be wakey, will make you feel a little bit better yeah, at 3 a.m. Okay. So, how about that I just pop that out and uh, make that for you? Well, as you're awake now, well, it would be a shame to be awake for no reason. So, how about if I make you uh, that tea there or, or bring the set over you? For you, of course, you get the first class treatment. I will make sure it's poured perfectly in front of you so you have the perfect brewed tea for you to enjoy. Sit back, relax, listen, and enjoy your trip around the world. How does that sound? It sounds great, doesn't it? Well, let me go and stick this in a brew for you. Okay, I'm just going to activate the tea a little bit here. Oh, apologies, I uh, will go make it now. And here we have your tea perfectly brewed here for you. This is an exceptionally expensive tea, and we only have the best tea here for all of our customers and passengers here aboard the flight here at British Air. Okay, so might I say, wow, I've just noticed now you look absolutely amazing. That must be really expensive clothing you've got there. Did you get that from? Wow. Yeah, yeah wow, that's incredible. Yeah, I saw, I think I saw that. That's, that's cost quite a lot. That costs about three of these tickets, doesn't it? Yes. If I just have a look there, and he said, but, but, oh my, oh my goodness, oh, oh my apologies, my sincerest apologies, oh I've got it all over your very expensive clothing there, oh goodness me, please, uh, please forgive me so much, I'm so sorry to wake you up there, uh, if I can just dab that, little, oh goodness me, I've done it again, uh, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm here, I feel a little bit nervous now, um, I hope that I and you're close. Oh my goodness, I've done it again. Oh, I haven't. These are close there. They, they really do look quite spectacular. Um, I feel so bad about that. Please, uh, uh, please accept this tea and uh, I will go and fetch the appropriate cleaning things to clean you up there and uh, get your expensive clothes thing uh, uh, to dry it and washed and everything like that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but, um, okay. Uh, don't worry about it then. No. Oh, that's that's great. That's that's so great of you. I feel so much better. So much better. So you enjoy that tea, and uh, I, I will leave you to it. And uh, trying to arrange something for the, your clothes there. Okay. Is that okay? I uh, once again, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. Does that sound good? Okay. I'll, I'll let you enjoy your tea. Please do enjoy the drink. It's good tea. Once again, I'm so sorry for creating that mess there. Well, if you, it uh, doesn't look that great, does it? But I'm afraid the shower is currently occupied in here. Okay, I think you'd probably need to just upgrade your ticket a little bit more to be able to use that. Um, but I wanted to bring you these complimentary teas I have selected here. You can have the four bunches as a, um, a sorry gift there for you for spilling it all over. Expensive clothing there. Okay, so we have all the teas numbered here for you. All in different order for ultimate confusion as well. Okay, so. Please 
is accept. Oh, very modest gift here. Just, just a small apology for ruining your very expensive bespoke tailored clothing. Okay. and just enjoy your flight as I'm sure you will. You look so comfortable. I mean, apart from that, you look like you don't know them really relaxing times. So these seats are designed for sleeping and relaxing and just switching off from anything and enjoying your travel experience. So I'm, I'm going to leave you to it now. Okay. Okay. I'm very aware of that. Thank you for telling me. Yes, and, and that's really 
Uh, lovely tone of voice there, of course. I know that you're trying to sleep and relax, yes. But I thought that she might like a hot towel. Yes, well, I wouldn't want my favorite passenger not to have a hot towel here on her flight. Well, I am designated to looking after you, so please allow me to give you this hot towel. So I'm going to pop it on your face there. We just take it off there. Pop this in my tray so we'll have two hot towels for you. Okay. Have a hot towel here. That's very hot. And this steamy hot towel here. Okay, that's equally as hot. Okay. So, if you would like to wipe your hands, I will just pop this on your hands. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I'm so sorry, Rene. Was that a little bit too hot for you? I thought you wanted it on your face. Oh my, my sincerest apologies. A steaming hot towel. That's what you, you get in that barber shop to open up your pores. I thought you meant you wanted it on your face and not to clean your hands. Oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Let me get the uh, cord towel there for you. This, this will really freshen you up, okay? Okay, this is going to make you feel a lot cooler. Let me just dab it around. Oh my goodness, uh, yes, oh, I'm so sorry. That's another steaming hot towel. That's another steaming hot towel. I apologize, my sincerest apologies. Uh, this is highly embarrassing. I did not mean to get you twice there. Uh, the trick is to allow the hot towel to relax itself and cool down naturally to a natural temperature and then you have to give it to the test and make sure that it is going to be safe to put it on your skin there okay so i'm so sorry about that so sorry now that is perfect temperature that feels your face okay yes it's okay yes yes it will look okay there. it looks great to me it really does look great um, apologies, yes, I uh, know I shouldn't touch you, I'm, I'm sorry for doing that again. Okay, so I'm just going to put this down, there we go, just, there we go, just a little bit around there, a little bit around there, just cooling you off, there, 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 and um, perfect, and just wiping off all of your, your makeup there, okay. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, that, uh, was that rude? Okay, so I'll, I'll just leave the, the towels here. Oh, you saw I get that other towel there, so I'll, I'll just lay that on your lap there. Okay, and we'll pop that one there on your lap there as well. Okay, I won't disturb you. You really do look tired. So if you need anything whatsoever, of course, call me. Otherwise, I'm not going to disturb you at all now. I'm going to let you sleep and enjoy the remainder of your flight. Okay, our British air is all about sleep and relaxation and uh, making the journey one of the best parts of your travelling to your destination. So please enjoy the experience. I will, I will leave you to your slumber now. Okay, thank you. Fragrances, 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 everybody's asleep, hello, hello there, hello there, just wake up, wake up, just, uh, it's just one more thing, I, I know that uh, you probably just fell into a little bit of deep sea there, but I was, I was wondering, compliments from British Air, uh, would you care for a spray of fragrances, a, a little puff? shall we say. Well, I've got two here, um, though I think this one will be more suited for you. Well, this is a really first-class fragrance, which when I smelt it, I instantly thought of you, and I thought that you would really appreciate having a nice puff of spray to make you smell absolutely amazing. I promise
promise you it will complement your bespoke tailored clothes there and you will look so great and it smells so great too I know it's getting late yes it's, it's I mean 4am I know you want some sleep but I should wear a puffer spray you know what they say puffer spray sends you to the hay yes but sleep you've never heard that before oh that's sure of course I can leave you so um, would you like me to spray you Perhaps you'd like to pop out your wrist there. Oh wow, that's a really expensive watch. Wow, that's so nice. Where did you get it from? Is that a puffer? Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. Please, uh, I'm so sorry. Did that get you in the face? Oh no. No, no. Let me, let me try to equal that out for you. Is that, is that no one? Not that I can't make that worse. I made that worse. I'm so sorry. Uh, are you okay? Would you like a hot towel? A steaming hot towel? No? Uh, yes, of course. Of course I can go, yes. Uh, I, I will leave you uh, to your sleep now. Uh, your face looks just a little bit red there. Uh, but you know what they say. Red face at night makes you want to sleep. Okay, so perhaps uh, that's exactly what I should leave you to do. Sleep and relax and uh, enjoy the rest of your flight. Okay, well, um, I've been here to uh, help you sleep and serve you uh, all throughout tonight. I really hope that your experience has been a real, really first class. I think we should be landing not too long now. Uh, so I really hope that you've had a relaxing sleep um i mean i know we've got about six hours left of the flight um, sorry to confuse you like that uh, let me give you a couple more puffs there this might improve your mood there just don't, don't worry about it don't, you don't need to say anything i'll just keep popping around i'll keep popping a little bit around you there to make you smile a little bit better to take your mind off that i've been such a terrible 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 terr
customer and company relations are at the forefront of this company's policy. So I really hope this has been a shining example of what we can offer you here tonight. And any flights you decide to take with British Air, thank you so much. I have been your host for this current moment in time. If you need me, I should be over there and waiting to serve you if you need anything whatsoever. Okay, oh, I will get out your hair now. I could sense that you're feeling a little bit tense there. Right, so just please calm down with me. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. Take care. Cheerio. Nice and calm.